Ah, before we get to the real important news of the moment, I just want to ask a question. What are we going to do in the next few weeks with two presidents in South Africa? It's like having a divorce and the husband and the wife live in the same house together. Cyril and Jacob are in residence in the same power base. And who's going to listen to who? Who's going to feed the cat? Who's going to drive the children to school? Who's going to cook? And who's going to do the washing up? It's a problem. I know the ANC is 106 years old in a few days' time. Ain't a dear look we all get to celebrate the fact that at the age of 106, the ANC still has a brain. Well, they say things will get better with Cyril Ramaphosa as the president of the ANC. And if Jacob Zuma gets his farewell gift of a one-way ticket to Dubai, well, things will, will settle down in this new year. But now let me get to the real news, the important news the most exciting news of the year. I want to congratulate all our South African young people for passing their matric exam, their 12th grade. I know it must be a wonderful excitement, not just for them, but for their parents and for their grandparents and for the people who have made it possible for them to do so well in the exam. Yes, that is the good news, but the bad news is also there. Now they must get jobs. There are no jobs. So what are we going to do about all these young people who want education free? That's not going to happen either. So let me just give a message to parents and grandparents. Please, don't let's be so obvious. Don't let's always say to our children, we want you to be a doctor, we want you to be a lawyer, you must be an accountant, do what we say. No, take one step back and listen to what your children want. Say to your children, what do you want to do with your life? You might not even know what they're talking about because the future is ahead of them. We, as their parents and grandparents, are already in our future. It's a very important moment. Don't force your ideas on the new generation. May Scott, I'm excited. I thought I'd wear color, I'd wear lovely things because it is a wonderful start to the new year. Now let's get back to the divorce. Evita, Evita, and you know what we mean. Evita, Evita, always on the scene. Evita, but say the note, Evita should be queen. <laughs>